An alarming case making national headlines tonight, a deadly shooting and a familiar defense. Stand your ground in Florida. Authorities say video showing a man chase down and threaten an Uber driver and his passenger. The pickup truck cutting them off on a dark road, the Uber driver then firing one fatal shot. The sheriff today defending the Uber driver, calling it a classic stand your ground case, saying it's a new day in Florida and in the United States. Here's ABC's Steve Osinsami. The video Florida police are sharing tonight is from the dashboard of the Uber driver, 38-year-old Robert Westlake, who's in the middle of a fair and happens to be a recent police academy graduate legally carrying a sidearm. For reasons he doesn't understand, the driver of this pickup truck who's been tailing him suddenly pulls in front of him. Out jumps 34-year-old Jason Boak, who had just left this bar in Dundee after a fight with his girlfriend. He thinks she's the one getting the ride. The police say she's still at the bar, and the young woman in the back seat is a stranger. I say something. When he threatens the driver with a gun that police never found, the driver shoots the man and he dies. Came towards me, shouted, he's got a pistol. This is a justifiable homicide all day long. Police are sharing these texts to the girlfriend, where Boak promises to find her and beat up her driver. Here's a message for the hotheads don't do that stuff. Good people carry guns, and they will shoot you. The Stand Your Ground law has some people in Florida outraged, but police say this case is textbook. Prosecutors are reviewing it. David? Steve Osinsami, thanks, Steve.